Bears are fascinating creatures that have roamed our planet for millions of years. They belong to the family Ursidae and are classified as caniforms or dog-like carnivorans. Although there are only eight extant species of bears, they are found in diverse habitats across the Northern Hemisphere and even parts of the Southern Hemisphere. From the dense forests of North America to the icy expanses of the Arctic, bears have made their mark. The Kodiak bear, native to the Kodiak archipelago in Alaska, is a subspecies of the brown bear and is renowned for its massive size. These bears have been isolated from other bears for about 12,000 years and have a unique genetic identity. They are primarily herbivores, consuming a diet rich in berries, plants and fish. The polar bear, on the other hand, is native to the Arctic and surrounding areas. It is closely related to the brown bear and the two species can interbreed. The polar bear is the largest extant species of bear and land carnivore. Unlike the Kodiak bear, the polar bear is primarily carnivorous, specializing in hunting seals. The Kodiak bear, being one of the largest brown bear subspecies, can rival the size of the polar bear. Adult male Kodiak bears can weigh up to 680 kilograms or more, with a height of 6.5 to 9 feet. In contrast, male polar bear weigh between 300 to 800 kilograms, with a height of 5.9 to 9.8 feet. Females of both species are notably smaller. Kodiak bears are restricted to the Kodiak archipelago in Alaska. Their habitat consists of dense forests, meadows and river systems. They have access to abundant food sources, especially during salmon spawning seasons. Polar bears, however, inhabit the Arctic and adjacent areas, including Greenland, Canada, Alaska, Russia and the Svalbard archipelago of Norway. They are dependent on sea ice, which they use as a platform to hunt seals. As the ice melts during summer, polar bears are forced onto land. Their survival is closely tied to the health of sea ice ecosystems. While both the Kodiak bear and the polar bear are contenders for the title of the biggest bear, they have distinct habitats and diets that have shaped their evolution and behavior. The polar bear, with its specialized hunting skills and dependence on sea ice, faces unique challenges with the changing climate. The Kodiak bear, isolated on its archipelago, remains a symbol of the wild beauty of Alaska. The polar bear is often regarded as the largest bear species on Earth. The largest polar bear ever recorded weighed an astonishing 10 or 2 kilograms, that is about 2209 pounds. This was a male from the Kotzebue Sound in northwestern Alaska back in 1960. In terms of height, when standing on its hind legs, it was about 3.3 meters tall, that is about 11.12 feet. The largest recorded wild male Kodiak bear weighed 751 kilograms. That is about 1656 pounds and is on display at the Anchorage Airport in Alaska. This particular bear stands about 3.5 meters. That is about 10 feet tall when on its hind legs. However, captive bears can sometimes grow even larger due to consistent food availability and lack of physical challenges. A notable example is a Kodiak bear named Clyde. Clyde lived at the Dakota Zoo in Bismarck, North Dakota, and weighed a staggering 966 kilograms, that is about 2130 pounds, when he passed away in June 1987, at the age of 22. Just a year before his death, Clyde's weight was close to 1089 kilograms, that is about 2400 pounds. 
While his exact height isn't documented considering his weight, he would have been an exceptionally tall bear, likely close to or exceeding the three meter mark. It's worth noting that while these records highlight the exceptional sizes some individuals can reach, they are not representative of the average size of their respective species. Both the polar bear and the Kodiak bear play crucial roles in their ecosystems, and their sizes have evolved to suit their environments and lifestyles. Thank you for joining us on this journey. If you enjoyed this exploration, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more awe-inspiring tales from the wild.